the problem with precision medicine and sequencing a patient that has often been leveled at us is you can't do it fast. We're going to sequence them and give me the result a month later. This is an ICU case. We need it now. And we showed in this case and in others, we can do this in 48 hours or less. So 48 hours or less, we can do the sequencing and turn around a result. And that's important because it's not like cancer where you have sort of a time lag to do things. It has to be done now. And it can be done now. And so that's what was done in this case. And I'll just jump to the results. In the virus categories, he's got um, viruses that everybody has. Uh, they, they're not pathogenic. But in the bacterial case, there's something there that shouldn't have been there. It's leptospirosis. So this kid had a bacteria in his brain. And uh, leptospira is the cause of, the, of leptospirosis, one of the most common zoonoses in the world. You get it from swimming in water that animals have peed in, and it goes in through your eyes. Uh, and he swam in fresh water in Puerto Rico, most likely the cause of this. However, they were depressing his immune system when he really had an infection. And so what's the treatment? The treatment, I'm not just going to blow by this, the treatment happens to be just penicillin. And so intravenous penicillin, 13 million units a day, get rid of the steroids, and that kid is discharged 14 days later.